So we've started uh, a challenge. Mm. If you guys remember last year, there was a group of a group of guys who did Fitness Feb. Um, it was that, like that's two years ago now, right? Was it two years ago? It has to be. No, because we went on that cruise ship. When was the cruise ship? The Sidemen cruise. There's ship. no way it was in. Remember, it was this is after Gibbs fight. Remember, actually, it must have. It has been, to, yeah. yeah, remember, remember we've because been with, Gib wouldn't have done it. The day, yeah, the month before yeah, his yeah. fight. We've had COVID for a year, mate. It's like I, 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 I that's how crazy. Insane. Yeah, so like it's, it's pretty much like last year doesn't exist. So <laughs> two years ago, in, in memories. Two years ago, a group of um like our group, yeah. kind of thing, YouTubers in the UK. Uh, and then, they started Fitness Feb. To be fair, I don't think. Yeah, sorry, go on. What were you gonna say? I was gonna say I don't think this is a this is just a coincidence. It's in February, right? Uh, no, we said like let's start it. Like we actually we said we might start on New Year's Day, and then we just kind of went like let's push it back to Feb. Yeah, but that's what I'm, what, it, it, yeah, it's no real correlation, but it's just because it's the closest month. Yeah, yeah, but still, it's, yeah. So um, it was like JJ, Freezy, Reeve, Theo, Ethan, blah blah blah. Yeah, there was like ten of them, I think. They basically had to try. They had a they had a band that you wear. Uh, around your like your chest and as your heart rate heart rate increases it gives you more points for yeah. every minute you spend in that heart rate zone and it was like who could lose the most it was or who could get the most meps was the points yeah. system and like at the end of the month they had a forfeit of you know who uh the bottom two have to then pay for a dinner for everyone mm. so i remember do you remember me saying like i'd love to do a fitness feb but not like fitness. I said something about like, oh, who could, you know, get the biggest percentage increase of views or yeah, put yeah. a bet on yeah. or something like that. And I said, I actually mentioned betting. Yeah. Cause although, you know, obviously although that, although, although that challenge is called fitness Feb and you know, it did encourage a lot of them to go out and be more active. It did, it went too far though. Like it wasn't, oh, healthy. Yeah. it wasn't healthy. Yeah. Like JJ ended up giving up after about five days. Yeah. And then he lost and Ethan lost. And they had to pay for a meal at Nobu, which ended up being like 8K each or something like that. Yeah, well, yeah, because I mean, obviously, if JJ is lost as well, he's going to self sabotage. Yeah, he literally he ordered stuff just to spite Ethan. <laughs> Didn't he <laughs> order like an like a X amount of money bottle of wine? He didn't yeah. drink wine. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but this time we decided, like, okay, what can we do that isn't something that's going to ruin lives? <laughs> yeah, because that, honestly, all of them stopped posting YouTube. Yeah, videos. yeah. But that, uh, so we've now come up with this this betting challenge yeah so we've all put 100 pounds into a betting site yeah no free ads no <laughs> uh so it's 100 pounds so it's not like not like massive nah know? it's just small it's a small amount you know i mean i'm, I'm sure yeah, i'm sure people spend yeah that on like a, a given Cause, weekend because we can't top that up it's 100 pounds yeah. you have that for the whole month and you have to literally you have to do at least 10 bets this month of two pounds each yeah should i go through the official rules sure I mean, listen. I feel like it's a nice thing to officiate. Um, so this started literally midnight, so f it's February. Yeah, to today. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. So hundred pound start, no revi. One loser based off profit or loss. Um, it's football only. Yeah. So you got like Freezy said, I was going to bet on it raining tomorrow. But yeah. You have to literally. It has to be football. Yeah. Minimum of ten bets must be made, and the stake at least two pound each bet. Balance posted every week, blah, blah, blah. Um, Feb 1st to 28th midnight. Yeah. So the way, but we have said the forfeit for this, there should, is actually a winner. Should we do it? Should we announce it at the end maybe? Because it might spoil the forfeit if we actually say what it is. No, nah, I think it builds. I think it builds more. No, nah, because I feel like, I think the whole point of that forfeit is that. Okay, like, okay. We, you know, we're you not going to tell you what it is, but the forfeit is a very good forfeit. Yeah. And you guys will actually see who the loser is. Yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah, the, considering this started at midnight, like February first, kind of thing, it's so funny the fact that, like when I when I thought of this challenge, I thought you know, oh, there'll be the Premier League games like Tuesday. There's like f four games. Yeah, so we'll all be in a group chat on the game. On the, the games game day, will happen. Yeah. Everyone will have like you know a couple pounds here, a couple yeah. pounds there. Everyone will be like, oh, uh, Arsenal just scored. Oh, yeah. blah, blah, blah. literally hit midnight. About five people had already put ten pounds of their one hundred pounds yeah. on the most random games ever. Yeah, I mean, shall I read? Shall I read out one of my bets last night? Yeah. So, like, um, obviously, you know, it's a hundred pounds. That's quite a lot still. That's still a lot. Of yeah, money, yeah. But no one is putting fifty quid on, or not yet. Anyway, no one's putting fifty quid on a bet. Yeah, it's, it's two pound minimum, and we've been doing a lot of two pounds. Yeah. You, you got to remember, guys. Like the. the 
the more you do, like obviously the more chance you've got on winning, but you know, then if you if you're down, then you're just gonna struggle to get back up. So everyone's been so conservative. It's just been funny, like like well, for example, like last you know, last night I put a bet on settled bets. Um I put no team to score in the second half of the Atletico San Luis women versus Club Tijuana women in the, <laughs> right. you know, and in whatever, whatever league that is. And bro, I was sat there. I was actually having a poo at the time. I was sat there on the on the app, like where it shows you just like a football manager top down view yeah. of like a little ball running around the pitch, attacking and defending. I was so nervous. My heart, my heart was beating on a. And you put how much money? Two, two pounds. Two pound, yeah. And your return would have been. My return would have been nine pound. But I cashed out for four pound twenty three. Like, I put a two pound bet on. Can you find the picture? <laughs> yeah, didn't you put a bet on like, the, the police team? <laughs> so it was two teams, and I put it was two all in the game, and I yeah. put next team to score. <sighs> so many screenshots in this chat, <laughs> and the team, the teams I put it on. I'm trying to remember what it was. Hold on, it's going to. I need to. Have you got it there? Uh, you've got. Modern Coast Rangers versus Administration Police. Uh, that you watching the game. Yeah, so it was... One... Okay, no, here you go. Next team to score. Yeah, so I put two pounds on. And if I won, which I did... You won three pound 82. One pound 82. Yeah, profit. profit. Yeah. And honestly, I'm bricking it. Yeah, like, yeah, you've yeah. Got, yeah. You've got nine YouTubers. When I say this, <laughs> the group is... But I, I walked into the... Uh, I walked into your room... And I was just sat by To start a podcast. And he was there, like, w- drinking a Costa. Um, <laughs> looking at the... Bro, it's honestly, these, these like, extra pounds are the maddest thing ever. Because, yeah. honestly, it's only an extra pound, 30, 80 or whatever. But that could be the difference. So, yeah, so it starts... You Obviously, start on 100 pounds. You've got to do a minimum of 10 bets. If I said in the chat, if you end up doing all your 10 bets and you're on 100, that's not that bad. No, I, th- then, I think the loser will be under 100. Yeah. There's no way... 10 there's nine of us i think there's no way nine of us go positive yeah and i know it's based on profit and loss but like that's zero. Zero, zero is a good profit and loss yeah <laughs> you know well, that's what did you see so ethan said in the chat today like oh it's not about your the, what you have at the end it's your profit loss and i was like yeah but we all started on 100 yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah. It, 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 <laughs> it's what you have at the yeah, end yeah I, I see what you meant <laughs> but like i think it is yeah yeah effectively the same thing i guess there might be a few weird weird no i think it is, it is it's the exact it? same yeah it's the same. everyone has started on yeah, hundred. If you look at if you look at profit and loss on a percentage, if you're a ninety, you've lost ten percent. Yeah, yeah. Um, so honestly, this it's. I thought it was going to be a lot more like okay, we'll wait till Premier League. We Maybe do like a couple championships. Yeah, we, we we do like five accumulators in yeah. a month on, on the Premier League. And I didn't championship. expect it to literally be people just looking for games to bet. Bro, on. I've got an accumulator on now. You know, I didn't I didn't, I didn't even tell the chat. Oh, I'll tell you now. I just went and did one. So but I've yeah, got like the, the there's only one game on tonight that's like. English League or something, and it's Watford QPR. Yeah, and everyone has a bet on it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I've got a, an accumulator for today. I think seven o'clock, seven forty-five, and eight o'clock kickoffs. A little bit spread out. I've got Porto to win. Okay. Watford to win. Okay. And then Betis to win against Osasuna. Okay. Now, and I, got, I don't often bet on football. Like I bet on like World Cups and stuff, but I don't. I'm not like a. I'm not like an accumulator pro. You know what I'm saying like, there's some people out there probably watching this who like just literally like can't lose, not can't lose. Obviously yeah. it's gambling, but like you're good at the game. It's, you know, it's that TikTok that guy was like googling like referees and how often, bro. I, look, in- I looked at Watford QPR. Yeah. I've seen. I I could tell you like uh, Watford. Oh, what do they get? They get on average they get like three three point four yellow cards for them. <laughs> two point eight yellow cards against them. Bro, you, you got to look up the referee and his mother. I and didn't like, look she, up the referee. She, that's what I need to look up. Is she a fan of Watford or is she a fan of QPR? <laughs> yeah. You never know. You know where she's actually, from. I'm trying to look up things like, you know, which teams are more likely, like how many goals have they been scoring recently? How many? Yeah. I'm trying to look it up, but then put two pounds on. Yeah. <laughs> like, all, all I did for this was I did, I just went on BBC. You know, it tells you the form. Yeah. I was like, are they, are they in form? Yeah. If they're <laughs> not, no. To like, is it green or red? Yeah. Yeah. Literally. Yeah. <laughs> but the one I'm worried about is the, uh, the Watford one. Cause anything can happen in championship. That's what I think. Yeah. Everyone's got Watford to win and they're all like, oh yeah, these are all sure. But, but I, put I, six, I put six pounds on it, you know. You put six pounds on that accumulator? Holy. Potential return. So if you lose this bet, yeah. if you lose the bets you have placed, yeah. like how much do you have in your account right now? I was on 100. I, 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 I was up and I put a three, I put a three pound 84 bet on Newcastle under 23 to score next and Burnley done them in 2-0. So no, no, no but like how, what do you have in your account now? 94. So you have 94. With that six pound bet on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'm a, 
I'm at like 99.8 now because I put two pounds yeah. on Watford and QPR to have one shot on target. <laughs> Yeah, nice, nice. That should happen. Surely, one Surely, shot on yeah. target. Each, you, you don't even make much half. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So they each have to have two shots on target. If they don't have two shots on target, what is that game? Yeah, like guys, we're, we're being very like conservative because obviously, like no one wants to lose. Um, and it's it's a hundred pound, right? Yeah. And I think isn't in the minimum minimum bet's two pounds. So like, what is that? that like, twenty times, right? That's twenty. No, fifty. Oh, fifty bets. Oh, yeah, two. Yeah, true. <laughs> well, my logic is, I want to try and turn that a hundred into like 120 and then use that 20 to try and like, then I start being a bit more experimental. Yeah, so then you can, like, you can afford to do 10 pound on one thing. Yeah, I'm trying to do these little two pound bets that only earn me two pounds maybe. Or yeah. like a pound 30, 40, That's 50, a smart way of doing it. And then try and get the profit to then bet. I never want to be crawling back. I feel like a few people in the chat now are crawling back from Bro, like 18, got, 95. 14 hours. Yeah, I don't want to be crawling. I, I, want to be, I want to be in a position of power at all times. Yeah. Yeah, so. But that's where it could get dangerous because you could be like, five pounds ahead of someone mm. and their bottom or whatever. And they just go, you know what? I have nothing to lose. Five pound on this, they win. Yeah. Or like 20 pounds on this, they win. You need to make sure that you never bet on leads, by the way. I work. No, I never. And that, because only then that's when, that's when emotional things play in. Play no, I never it. bet on leads. Firstly, because I can't bet against them because it's leads. Yeah. And I never bet on them because leads are, them. they are, they are the team that if you have leads in your accumulator, yeah, I'll let you down. But, but also, it's like emotional, and it? because I remember when when it was the World Cup, I actually was doing well with my bets until it got to England, and I bet the whole thing on them winning. Oh. <laughs> you know, it's like you're, you're not going to bet against them. Yeah. Oh, you know, really, gonna... you just don't bet on them. Yeah, like let, your happiness slide. shouldn't come from your bet; it should come from them winning. Yeah, and if you do bet, just bet on something like yellow cards. Yeah, where it's or like corners or something doesn't like affect that, that sort of result yeah. type thing. You know, yeah. so it's going to be interesting. We'll keep you updated um, every week. We'll let you know who's who's doing well, who's not. I think Bog's doing. Uh, Harry's doing the best so far. Yeah, he had. He, I think he he went big early. I think he was the first person to come in and be like, I've I've put some weight down. I was struggling, but he, he, like he a, won a big bet, didn't he? Like he won a 16 like a 10, pounder. I think it was 10. Okay, he cashed yeah. out, I think. Oh, okay, 10, yeah. Like that. That's that's big though, isn't it? Yeah, that's big. But, but I cashed out on four pound and everyone was applauding me. Right now, <laughs> like, right now, Reeve is Reeve and Freezy are doing the worst. I thought Reeve was gonna win. But Reeve won an accumulator about two days ago. Yeah. That was like 450 pounds. Off like uh, off like five. Yeah. So there is always a chance, like as long as he has money in that account. Yeah. You can always win an accumulator. Yeah, but, but then as soon as you know that like, if someone if someone does that, they've they're, they're safe. And someone else does that, and you start being the only one who hasn't gone like outrageous yet, and you yeah. you know you think, oh man, like, I'm gonna lose. I got to put like a twenty pounder on, and then yeah. So there slippery is a slope, man. There is a prize for the winner. Yeah, but there's a forfeit for the loser. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not fussed about winning. No, I, just, I just don't want to lose. Not want to. Yeah, lose. yeah, but that, that's why we can't announce it on here. Yeah, but we'll explain what it is in the end. Yeah. Um, I mean, you'll see. You'll, you'll see. see. It's gonna be funny, yeah. And it's, just, it's I'm enjoying it. It's fun, really. It's just, like, and I've, I mean, I enjoy F FPL, like fantasy football, because of like you get engaged in the games more. Yeah, I just get really bored of like changing, and then you see, Each, oh, yeah. someone's not in the team, and it's like complicated. It's a lot of work. It's very lot. But and then again, it, it just it, it, what I'm saying is it enhances your enjoyment of football. Yeah. Now I want to, you know, bro. I, I, I've been doing you, as you know. I've not done any transfers like ages. Yeah. Like Martinez is and uh, Banford done bits. Um, Salah's my captain. He just scored right. two, but he's, he's, been, he's been doing, he's been blanking each week. But I actually had like a sick week last time right. by mistake. But yeah, so they, again, it, it gives you know, it gives us excitement. I mean, albeit we are watching like, you know, like, you know, uh, the Brazilian like C League. Yeah, <laughs> you know, and, and yeah, but that's what like it's fun, isn't it? For example, the fact that I've put a bet on the Watford QPR game. Yeah, I'm actually gonna pay attention to yeah, it. Yeah, like, and it it makes me like I'm, I might put like uh, the only thing I wish is I wish it wasn't two pound bets minimum because I'd put fifty p on every single game. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's a like, good rule. Whoever, uh, whoever made that, Freezy, I don't know. Nah, but I, I don't like it. Oh, because I'd put fifty p on every single game, and I'd watch every game. True. Yeah. Like I'd be like fifty p on Arsenal to have four corners. Yeah, but I feel like there has to be. <laughs> there has to be like, it has to be a minimum because otherwise, otherwise people are going to move so slow. You have to be putting stuff out there yeah, and risking a bit, yeah. and then two pounds is not much of a risk. But like Harry's already done over ten bets. Yeah. So he could stop. Yeah. You could literally could stop be a, now, try and wait till the last week, and then see. But no one will. It's gonna end soon, but it's it's there's no buy-ins. Yeah, it's like you know, and a hundred pound, like it's not that much really. Like now, nah, because everyone will wait. If you get to like sixty, seventy, you'll start waiting just to see what other people. True. Will on. True. But yeah, it's me, Randolph, Harry, Freezy, Reeve, Ethan, Chris. Theo, Chip, Chris. I think that's it. Yeah, I don't know who you said. Like, yeah, said read, read the chat. Yeah, it's a nine. But yeah, Wait, it's fun, Theo man. Just said, oh, Theo just put a bet on. Oh god, he put two pounds on. 
potential ret- uh, returns was six pounds, and he just won it. No way. Wow. Oh, and Harry's put a bet on it as well. Oh, my God. Bro, it's getting tasty. They're literally betting on Istanbul Spore. No. Yeah, Istanbul Spore versus Izmir. I don't, like... <laughs> like... Bro, he says that he put a bet on it and they scored 20 seconds after he put the bet on. Yeah. But that's what I feel like everyone's going to do is they'll just look at, like... Oh, my God. He's actually done it on the toilet. That's what this is going to become. That that's what, That's the whole thing is. It's literally just, like, fueling... Fun. Yeah, yeah. It's, like it's, the it's, boredom it, is just. It's like, nothing to do with like gambling, really. Like we're putting this money into you know lose, blah blah blah. It's not yeah. really like we're not looking to make money. It's just literally a group of friends having fun. Like I would genuinely recommend. I'm not saying recommend. I'm not recommending betting. No. But try and find something like this. Yeah, especially during like, lockdown. Yeah, during lockdown because yeah. literally this is you know I don't talk to Chris. The, uh, like, yeah, I, no, I don't not, talk yeah. to them much. Like I talk to them a lot. Like, not, they're like, they're they're good, not, not as very, much as this. Yeah, they're all very good mates, but. I'm not in a group chat with them. This now has meant I'm now talking to them every single day. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, and it's just cured a lot of boredom. Yeah, and that's that's the same. What I think again, these two topics are very close together because like it's the same thing with like the Dogecoin as well. It's not like I'm, I'm, we're not looking to make money. We're not we're not suggesting you guys to make money, but it's just something to do, isn't it? Yeah, like I could literally lose twenty quid on this as long as I don't lose the competition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm very happy. Yeah, and obviously like you know, and twenty quid for a month. Bro, we're we're getting think... nervous on putting two pound down. Yeah, you know it's it's, it's fun, and, it, and that's, that's why originally, obviously, JJ was like, "Why didn't you put like a grand down each?" But then it, then it becomes like, then I'm actually caring. Like, yeah. Then I, I actually feel like I actually feel like shit if I lose a grand. Yeah. Whereas like, if I lose a hundred pounds, it's like I have, that that's been, been worth the fun. That's what I mean. It's not the money isn't the actual thing. It's the competition. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. 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 Um. Well. Well. Also, I'm gonna say, hopefully, um, go and check out the fellows podcast as well, because hopefully, like, they'll talk about their because oh, yeah, they're freezing both in it. Yeah. True. So well, nasty. That... Put a bet on yet? You're not. I don't think so. Yeah. Well, we thought we thought we were trying to egg him on, weren't we? To be the first person to put yeah. like a fifty pound bet on. Fifty pounds on Bayern to win against bottom of the league or something like that. Yeah. Uh, who yeah. knows? 